off-grid stores here just to try to show you a quick unboxing video of an EcoFlow Delta Max. And one thing to say here is this has already been unboxed. I uh, kind of forgot about that aspect, but just wanted to show you I've kept everything that comes with the box and with the product just to show you what it looks like and what you get when it shows up if you buy from us. So one thing, if you find this video helpful, please be sure to hit the like button down below. We can get this video out to more people that need help or want to see what this looks like. And if you wanna see more videos like this, please be sure to also subscribe to the channel. It will help the channel get started and grow and hopefully turn into something great. So let's get into it. So basically the box looks like this. It shows up, it's about 25 inches wide. It looks pretty nice. Everything's got the special little EcoFlow tape and you know, they really do go above and beyond with their packaging and everything like that. So I had to weigh the box down. So let's not look at these. Basically everything comes super well packed inside of here, all pressed into the styrofoam, which everything is then placed in there. So the EcoFlow will be in there. That's where the top goes and then the box is just sitting inside or this black box that I will show you. So let's get this box out of the way just for the sake of the video. Throw that off to the side. Now let's show you everything that does come with it. So this is pretty much all you will need in order to make the EcoFlow work. Obviously, if you want to run it off solar panels, you will need solar panels involved, which we also do sell and provide. So let's talk about it. So one thing I do like is this box right here. And again, with the EcoFlow branding, it's just super sleek. They do their branding very well. And you know, they really go above and beyond and make it look like they really care. So firstly, let's talk about this. We have the user manual. Gives you pretty much everything you need to know, although the unit is not very complicated, you know, it has what you need in here. It also comes with a 24 month warranty. All you have to do is register and pretty much just do that. You'll get 24 months. Every EcoFlow, I believe, comes with it. I cannot speak for the lower versions, like the rivers and stuff. Don't really have much experience with them. And now let's get into the cables. So most importantly, you're going to have this cable. If you're buying it from us, you're probably gonna be buying it with solar panels and you're gonna need these. This plugs straight into the back of the EcoFlow. And then this will plug straight into your solar panel array, however you have that set up. Super simple, super easy with the MC4 connectors and it really just makes it extremely easy to get started. So let's go to this cable next. This is going to go into your car it's going to take a while to charge your EcoFlow with this. This is like, you know, just for fun or maybe a last ditch effort. I don't think it's really worth it or something that you really want to be doing. And then right here, again, into the same port in the back of your EcoFlow, which I'll show you later on in this video. Now we have the third and most powerful way to charge the EcoFlow. It's going to go straight in the back, kind of like a computer does and then straight into a wall outlet right there where that white cap is on it. You can charge the EcoFlow Delta Max right here at 1800 watts. So you can pretty much charge the whole thing in like an hour. And then this is a DC5521 to DC5525 connector. It'll go on the back, you can power um, some smaller electronics and everything like that. So this all does come inside of this box. Again, I already took it all out, so um, yeah, I'm not gonna be very good at putting it all back in there. So now let's get into the EcoFlow. I'm gonna put it down for a second just to move it and get it in better lighting. All right, so real quick, just to look at what we have here button-wise or outlet-wise, sorry. We have two USB-A, I guess it would be considered slow charge because these are the two USB-A fast charge. And then we've got two USB-C plugs right here. 
And then if you want to turn it on, you actually do have to press this. One thing is if you don't turn off these inverters like that, when you're not using them, what you can actually do with the app, if you don't turn them off, you're going to just drain the battery. So, you know, if you're not using it or if you're not using it at night, then go ahead and just turn it off. Right here, the IoT reset. So if you need to connect to the actual app with your phone, there's actually a sticker right here as well. When I went to scan this QR code, it actually didn't work, but all you have to do is just go into the app store, type in EcoFlow app and you should be good. So that's pretty much it for the front. You know, you've got input, output, both in watts, percentage, and then how many hours it'll last with that percentage. So if we were to turn on all the inverters, it might actually lower. Let me try. Yeah, see, so you just hear, heard it click on. I don't know if you heard that. I'm gonna show you how long it would last because it's powering the inverter. So it does draw some amount of energy. So. Like I said, when it's not in use, you want to turn them off. As you can see, we just gained some hours. So now I'm going to put it down. We're going to go to the side of the unit. No, I can just do the side right now. So here's the fans. They do get some amount of noticeable noise. You know, they're not really loud, loud, but you can hear them. And then these are going to be where you would plug in your extra batteries. So you can expand it from two kilowatt hours up to four and then up to six if you plug two of them in. So now I'm going to put it down and we'll go to the back of the unit. So the back of the units, probably the most important. Like I said, there's the QR code in order to go to the app store. And then right here, pretty much where you're going to be charging it. Both the solar panel or both the solar charging and the car charging goes in this port. This is where you're going to charge with AC and you can do slow charge, fast charge. You can mess with that on the app. It's pretty cool. I'll have a whole video on the app at one point. And then this is going to be the overload protection if you're charging it too fast with the AC. That's pretty much all it'll trip for. On the back, we got six AC outlets, which on the EcoFlow Delta Max, which is bigger, it only has four. Um, so it does give you more. You want to turn on the inverter. If I if I'm quiet, you'll probably hear it turn on that little clicking noise. And then down here, another 12 volt on off. And then this is going to be where the DC 5521 to DC 5525 plugs go. And then also you can do a little cigarette for it. I'll it right here. Everything looks super well built and is super well built. Very sleek on the bottom right here is kind of more of a rubbery material. So it doesn't slide. It's about 50 pounds, 48 pounds. So, you know, it's not light, light, but again, it has everything you need. There's two more fan ports on the back and then the actual logo. I love this unit specifically. And, you know, hopefully this video shed some light on, on it. Also more of a rubbery texture right here. Super nice, super well built. Have had no issues with it so far, minus that minor screen issue. Sometimes when you press the power button on the front, it kind of could be a little delayed sometimes. That might just be me being antsy. So hopefully this video helped. If you're interested in checking out any of our units, kits, or anything that we have, check out Off Grid Stores. The link's down in the description. Also be sure to like this video and subscribe to see more like it in the future. Thank you very much.